Hello everybody, this is Kirby over yonder, and the tip of the Zoidberg is a very fascinating episode. It's one of very few episodes to solely focus on Zoidberg, and says a lot about his character. It's also partially a flashback episode, one that is structurally very similar to one of the best episodes, Luck of the Fryrish, where the plotline in the past happens to coincide with the plotline in the present. We get to see why Farnsworth kept Zoidberg around for all these years, so that he can eventually kill him before he dies of hypermalaria. I personally really like the idea of giving Zoidberg a backstory. It helps make him feel like he has an actual purpose on the show. He's not just a comedic bit, you know? Act 1 has a lot of fun Zoidberg wackiness. Not only is this scene very funny, but it also does a good job showing how distrusting the rest of the team is of Zoidberg, and also makes us the audience question why Farnsworth keeps Zoidberg around if he's not good at being a doctor. Ay caramba! The montage of Zoidberg trying and failing at killing the professor is also very comedic, very Looney Tunes-esque. On a side note, this is probably one of the darkest episodes in all of Futurama. I mean, how often do we see the crew on the show try to murder each other? Aside from that anthology of interest short, of course. I also really enjoyed the Rube Goldberg-like killing machine the crew creates to murder Farnsworth. It's very complex and really well designed. The only thing in this episode that I'm not particularly crazy about is the twist that the professor actually had yetiism the whole time. It's not that it doesn't make sense necessarily, it's just that it feels like a bit of a cop-out to me. It's not a huge deal or anything, just something I don't personally care for. However, I do really like the ending of this episode. It would have been very easy for the episode to end on Zoidberg being sad as a joke, but I'm glad they threw him a bone this time and gave him a happy ending. It's nice. Overall, while not the best episode out there, I feel like this episode does a lot of things that Futurama generally does really well. Good action, good comedy, good backstory, some darkly funny moments, and genuine emotion sprinkled on top. It's actually one of my favorite episodes of the Comedy Central era. Don't get me wrong, it's no late Philip J. Fry, and like I said before, I'm not crazy about the twist, but if you like Zoidberg, you'll like this episode. I mean, we all know what the most influential people on the planet say. Why not Zoidberg? So everyone make sure to stay safe, have a good day, and... Whoop, 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 whoop. I'm very sorry about that, everyone. Have a have a good night. <laughs>